What's good, you Twitch boy Dev? Back again for another first list. Y'all know it's right there, man. What's good, Twitch boy Dev? Back again for another live list. Y'all know it's right there, man. Hey, today we are going to listen to a new track. First of all, Happy New Year's. Happy New Year's, everybody, man. Welcome to 2022. I was about to say 2021. 2022, man. First of all, hey, everybody. Welcome to 2022, man. Um, This is the year of the grind. The come up was last year, man. This is the year of the grind. Now we continue the motherfucking grind. We motherfucking created the foundation for the last five years. You know, now we kind of cemented it down for 2021. And now this is where we build the motherfucking towers, all right? 2022 is where we motherfucking grind it out, all right? But 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, no debate slash big smoke. He dropped a track. Um, it is trending on YouTube, obviously. Twenty One Savage, one of the more popular artists in um, today's rap scene, and then also uh, Gunna is dropping on Friday. If y'all didn't know, Gunna is dropping on Friday. I think that Twenty Twenty One started off real sluggish. I always said that Twenty One. If 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 you had me in the first half was in um, music form, that Twenty Twenty One was cl- was literally that. 2021 started off sluggish as fuck, and then that second half really roared, and I'm using these big ass, why the fuck am I talking about this? 2020, the second half was crazy, all right, we got Donna, we got CLB, we got all that motherfucking, all the shits, you know, uh, you know, shit dropping, and now 2021, it seems like we got some fire dropping with this 21 Savage, and we got Gunna, that's all I'm gonna say about this, but um, it's called No Debate, Big Smoke, like always, hey, Devon, man, welcome to the stream, man, like always, man, Ben, ASMR, Talking too much, man. We got what I just fucking said. Y'all ready? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's how y'all feel. Okay. Remember what I told y'all, man? I know y'all hate me low. Yeah, it's, it's been six years, man. Get used to this shit, man. All right. Um, but you know the one thing I always said too that people didn't really understand, man. I said this when he did a lot with J Cole, and I said that J that Twenty One Savage on a on a on a cool kind of like chill jazzy type beat more old school type sound 21 savage actually fits into that persona his voice is so relaxed and yet so aggressive and he's found himself to to, to really slide think about the track uh 1238 with 20 uh, with, with childish gambino um you know the track that he just did with j cole on both albums um you know, uh, uh, what's another track that he did that was created with Gunna? Can't Leave Without It. That's another one that he's did. He's done so many of these, like, now slower kind of R&B, not R&Bs, but old school um, soul tracks. And, and it's crazy how, you know, it, it, it just fits him. And I think that hearing this track right here, man, if he continues to do shit like this, man, he is going to, you know, he's going to keep doing the damn thing. I feel like 21, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, was an artist. That's motherfucking 21 right there. Can't find no words to describe what I feel inside. Go against the gang, yo, respect for Instagram. Gangsters got a tad some. He was talking crazy, caught him lacking at a gas pump. Oh, this that vibe. Hold on. Hey, we got to make, oh, yeah, we do got to make the new one. My bad. Let me hold on make that Spotify playlist right now. Um, most fire of 2022. We gotta make that, man. Hold on, let me let me make that real. Hold on. I just forehead long, flip the switch, nigga dumb. Four L love me, they protect me, secret service like I'm Trump. You can feel my presence where I came in the building. Oh. I'ma put some condos in my hood, I get a billion. Lost my right hand and my arms and it killed me. Wash away the trauma with the drugs, but I need. I think the, the thing too with 21 Savages, man, he just so, you know genuine with his raps right everything that 21 savage is saying you know again i always talk about a, a credibility you feel me like if an artist is talking about what he does then he better have have done it and i think that a lot of people know that 21 savage does what he does what does what he says and um even though he kind of has a very weird persona you know not saying weird but very kind of just dark and calm creepy vibe to him i just think that when he actually speaks about his his upbringing and you know and, and his experience in life man it's just you know you, you as i always tell you man the street niggas is going to gravitate to the niggas that that speak that real and that's exactly why a lot of motherfuckers from the hood, you know, he, he speak hood anthems. You feel me? They poof the caddy, take a couple of M's, put them in the safe. Yo. Then I took my brothers and put them all in place. 21. I know niggas. Dog, do you, do you know what, man, that nigga, man, 21 is, is growth. His growth is amazing. And I don't mean be his raps because his raps is still the same way, but his growth is amazing. Like, I feel like he's just gotten better. Like, his his beat selection has gotten better and what to rap on. Like, 
he knows before I always question, I always say his lyric his lyricism is is whatever, man. Like in terms of technical flow, you know, ability. Like he's had the same shit. But again, it's not about what you say, it's how you say it. I've always preached this. It's about what you it's not it's not about what you say, it's about how you can say it. Drake is literally the perfect example of that. So um with 21 Savage, man, his ad lib game is crazy. You know, uh, his his beat selection has now become better accustomed to the way he sounds, and it just it, it brings out a better. It just brings it out better, brings his voice out better. So I just think that man with Twenty One Savage, man, like he just knows he knows that he knows the uh, the cheat code to his game, and he's going to play his game to the fullest. You feel me? Oh, so so he brought old Twenty One. And new 21. The best of both worlds. For the niggas that want the old. Uh, <laughs> Young Savage, why you trapping so hard? <laughs> 21. Hey, this, this sounds like some meat shit with Spaz on. Nah, this shit sound crazy. This literally sounds like no heart. Back in the day, 21 Savage. Savage mode. Trapping with no pistol. Get the fuck out for the block. Sleep with my Matt 90. I fell in love with the stock. Nigga, I cut my sister I'm giving out big smoke, big smoke. Got I'm telling you, man, his his tracks, his beat selection has literally improved tenfold. The man knows what he sounds good on. All right. He knows what he sounds good on. The man is in tune with thyself. Where's that from? He got it, broad day. I ain't trying to fist fight none of you niggas. Straight to the gunplay. I got engaged to the street. Oh dog. my god! This is my fiance. Oh, bitch. That's from Glock in my lap. Okay, I, 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 I figured it was from a song that he's already done before. Like I know that Glock in my. But Lance tried to save him. They was disappointed. That's dope. I always say, man, I, I'm, you know, I, I've come to appreciate a lot of those artists that came from that XXL uh, freshman, what, 2016, I believe it was. Don't quote me on that. It might have been 2017. Um, it's been a long ass time since I've been doing this. So, um, you know, I always say that's that's probably the most legendary XXL in terms of success. Uh, literally, all of those people on on that XXL are successful. Like all of them, every single one. Is successful, um, so it's kind of crazy when you think about it, man. How legendary that uh, XXL list was, and I think that Twenty One Savage, man. You know, I'm 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 not gonna lie. I counted them out. Uh, I definitely was counting them out when I first um, listened to them. Um, very kind of lackadaisical flow. Uh, you know, very straightforward, simple. Um, now simple but effective. I think that you know when you listen to Twenty One Savage, there's this calm, eerie demeanor about them that um you know that that. When you first listen to him, it's like where you're going with this. But as his career has blossomed, you can kind of see, you know, um, he's been kind of playing around with that, you know, uh, carnival uh, saw jigsaw, you know, um, uh, what's that show called? Uh, purge type of music, I guess you could say theme. Um, you know, he definitely has that like, you know, you know, he, he's always been talking about, you know, murder and killings and whatnot and um, for him, 21 Savage is so calm and peaceful, yet so, you know, aggressive and, and evil in a sense, bro. It's, it's just like, you know, he just has this weird, just like eerie vibe to him, dog. Like, you know, cold, very cold. And especially the way he raps, you know, even when he rapping like he happy, he just sounds like, you know, like, nah, I'm, 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 I'm going to kill you on God. And then I'm going to shoot you. 21. Then I'm going to fuck your bitch, pussy. <laughs> like, 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 oh God! <laughs> this ain't what you want. I got on smoke twenty one, <laughs> smoking on his toe. Fuck your bitch, her throat. Oh God! <laughs> That's how that nigga be rapping. And then the whole time you just be sitting there, just like twenty one. <laughs> you like? I don't know why he said that, but. That shit's fire, bro. What up, Chav? But um, yeah, man, this this is this is cool, man. Definitely a a a a great starter to the year, man. Um, I, I'm I'm waiting for 21 Savage album. Actually, come to think about it, man, I don't think 21 Savage dropped last year. I know he did. Um, 
He did have that mixtape, but it was more so the Jigsaw. I know that was for the, for the Saw movie, so I don't really count that. Uh, I'm waiting for his actual album, though. He did a lot of features, so that was kind of cool. I want to see what his next album, what he's going to do. Uh, oh, no, no. Savage Mode 2 was 2020. Yeah, so that's tw- that was 2020. So Savage Mode 2 was 2020. And, um, yeah, man, I can't, I can't wait till he, he drops this year. Um, the way it's moving, if this might be his first song. Uh, if it's like this, if we get motherfucking 13 more of these, 14 more of these, pfft. Hey, y'all already know how it goes. Motherfucking banger. Man. Motherfucking classic. You know, that's how I'm going to say it, man. So, that being said, man, get in the comments below. Man, what you think? Don't forget, follow me on social media, what you hear. If you want to watch the full video, it is on Patreon, as always, man. Welcome to 2022, y'all. Um, it's more dev, more grinding, more found- uh, more building on the foundation that we already have, man. We're going to continue to grow. We're going to continue to do the damn thing. And, um, yeah, till the next time, it's boy dev. 3,000 likes to get new vinyl on the wall, even though the wall is damn near filled up. But uh, just for the support, love y'all boys, man. Shows a lot of love, man. But till the next time, it's boy dev. Till next time we're out. Love y'all. Peace.